It is November 29, 2021. President Biden had uh, some kind of, if you even want to call it, press conference about uh, this um, new variant that I don't even remember the name of it because it's obviously irrelevant due to all these uh, new names, new boosters, new variants uh, are coming out every couple of weeks, every couple of months. So who, who can keep track anymore? But you got to read between the lines, okay? Why, why was this press conference so pushed by the mainstream media? Why is it all over Twitter as, um, you know, basically breaking news? President is talking about the new deadly variant. You just got to understand that the narrative has to continue on. A lot of you know this by now, and a lot of people who were <laughs> making fun of a lot of tinfoiled hats people out there are now realizing what is really going on. They're just kind of like stuck. They believe they're stuck, and they're continuing with, um, with this uh, bullshit. So basically, a taper from the Fed Reserve we're going to slow down with mortgage back buying of uh, mortgage backed securities. We're going to uh, start looking into lowering our spending. Basically, none of this was going to happen. None of it is happening. It is QE, quantitative easing to infinity and beyond. And scapegoat is continuing to be c-o-v-i-d and all the variants that come with it okay because you have to point fingers at something else not at those in charge who make all these uh insane policies that are in a way right now almost turning into like they're 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 sadistic okay and a lot of people are not realizing this until they wake up one morning and and realize what really was taking place right before their eyes, but they were blind enough uh, to do their own due diligence, just to open their own eyes and ears instead of listening to mainstream media talking heads 24 seven. Okay. I hope you're not one of those. And if you know somebody share these videos, wake people up, let them know. Okay. Let them know this is deliberate destruction of the middle class, the dollar is looking really good when you're looking at DXY, the Dixie, the dollar index, because this is just a basket of currencies. They're all backed by nothing. It's just the dollar is the world's reserved currency. So when people see the stock market going up, they see Dixie going up, they believe this is, this is looking good. We are in a booming economy. This is why the illusion has to continue. And if things go so bad that those who are asleep can even see it, the bureaucrats will just point fingers at COVID variant, the flavor of the day. Remember that. The Great Reset is communism. And the best friend, the right hand of communism is man-made famine. I've been telling you about this for close to two years ago when this whole madness started, even before on Parlor in 2018 when i started telling people to prepare you are ahead of the herd you will do a lot better than most people and if somebody is coming to get what's yours i suggest you get very good with self-defense um let's just call it i won't even say details but you un better understand if you have a gun or any kind of fire you know what at your home if it's not properly cleaned if you are not testing them if you are not uh, very good in using them it is pointless to have them so make sure you train and train your brain the shit is going to hit the fan very very soon and the longer they prolong this madness the harder it's going to get. This is not to scare you, it is to prepare you. What's happening uh, right now, ladies and gentlemen, is nothing to what you will see. I made my videos based on everything you're seeing right now. The Great Reset is communism, period. 
when people stop getting the STEMI checks or if they do continue to get STEMI checks in even greater amounts, but they can buy less and less, it's when the revolution starts, okay? This is just history. I lived through it. I, I know what is coming. I've been taking you step by step, phase by phase, showing you examples of what's going on, why is it going on, and how to see this world through a different lens. You got to detach from this. You have to just be self, as self-sufficient self as possible and you have to think for yourself, okay? If you cannot afford land right now, if you think it's too complicated or whatever, you cannot get your hands on, on more real things, find a way, start digging while there is still a chance and do something about it. If you don't feel like doing anything about uh, having your own food, which would be totally uh, in my opinion, insanity, you know where to go. Independence Arc, let me know. This is all uh, grass-fed beef, as you can see, right back in the back. We still got a uh, pretty, it's, it's not green, but the grass is still pretty good out here. The weather is not um, as bad as I thought it would be. Uh, now almost up going into December. Obviously, we got hay, we got all kinds of stuff. Uh, we ship them frozen. But again, we are a very small operation. This is mostly for, uh, for us and our family. Uh, this is small channel. If you need something, let me know. But I hope you do it yourself, okay? Get self-sufficient yesterday. Take care and understand it is all smoke and mirrors. Continue preparing. Take care and God bless you all.